Prince Harry and Meghan Markle recently concluded a successful three-day visit to Nigeria. Despite no longer serving as official working royals, critics compared the trip to a traditional royal tour. Royal author and expert Tom Quinn exclusively told The Mirror, Harry and Meghan see their recent trip to Nigeria as a huge success. However, Quinn also noted, for Harry, every success is another kind of failure while his family refuses to acknowledge his efforts and steadfastly refuses to apologize for everything that had happened in the past. Despite the success of the trip, Quinn observed, in Nigeria and even with Meghan at his side and regularly holding his hand, he still has a permanent look of bitterness on his face. For all things royal, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's dive into the world of the British royal family together. The trip was widely deemed a success, and Harry and Meghan hinted at future visits in a message thanking the people of Nigeria, describing it as, the first of many trips. However, these, full royal tours have the potential to deepen the ongoing royal rift, according to public relations expert Lynn Carrot. Carrot told The Mirror, their Nigerian tour bared all the hallmarks of a royal tour, which was said to have infuriated the palace. Carrot also noted that if these tours are related to their independent work, like the Invictus Games, then these tours are good for the PR of their brand. I don't believe the Nigerian tour helped to increase their popularity in the UK and USA, Carrot added, but it did showcase to the African nations the work the couple can do and will certainly have increased their popularity there. What are your thoughts on Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's trip to Nigeria? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more royal updates and other important news. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.